first thing I was impressed with was the, was the noise, the sound. Especially being a V10, it's difficult to get that right pitch, and this car sounds very much like, like a Formula One car. Uh, not, not this big throaty sort of, you know, V8 type thing, but this beautifully pitched, uh, finely tuned racing engine. The next thing I was impressed with was the braking. Phenomenal. This is the first car I've ever been in that truly has the potential of braking that, uh, that a race car has. Absolutely phenomenal. You gotta have that edgy to have that performance, to have that braking, to have that feel that people want out of a supercar. This thing was bred at Fuji. Miles and miles and miles of testing on, on one of the greatest tracks in the world. I love the, the, the Lexus refinement. Just a beautifully finished interior. You'll notice that's, that's the Lexus feel when you lay your foot into it. Now you got that aggressive sort of heart pounding, adrenaline feel. This is a car that's hard not to drive fast. <laughs> that's another piece that I love about, about Lexus, uh, is the fact that we have this VDIM system. It's when you get into kind of nasty situations, the control and the braking is done almost seamlessly. And for a lot of people who buy this car, it's gonna protect them from getting into trouble. And if you wanna shut it off, you also have that ability. Carbon fiber, I think, has truly been developed through racing. It, it, it gives you the rigidity that you want from a performance car, uh, but also the lightweight you need for a performance car. When you take that sort of car to the racetrack and you really wanna uh, take advantage of, of its heritage, of its thoroughbred uh, racing characteristics, you're gonna use the brakes hard. With carbon fiber, it's a higher potential for, uh, for friction under, under braking as well. So you get, you're getting the best of both worlds, race car technology. It's, it's race car-esque. You don't have this over bulky steering column. You don't have this, these, these bulky seats. You don't have these bulky mechanisms that are kind of hanging all over the thing. It's all highly refined, uh, very light, very nimble. When you get into the turn, you have good understanding of where the car is at any moment, uh, confident of coming back to throttle. Uh, it's, it steps right back into the throttle, so you have good control, uh, and you can modulate to just jump right off the turn.
Thank you, sir.